In this video, I'm going to deal with two different things. One is a file upload and another one is a file download. First, we look at the file upload. Click on the file upload functionality here, the choose file button. And once you click on the choose file button, you will be able to select a file from the local drive. You can select file from anywhere in your local drive and select the file. Your file got selected and click on upload button. Where you have to verify this particular file is uploaded properly or not. Let's see this in how to handle this by using CLM C Sharp. Let's go to your code. I'm just creating the instance for the Chrome driver and now getting to the URL and then maximize the browser. Then I have to click on this particular choose file button. Take the property of this choose file button, right click inspect element. The ID is the file upload. ID is file upload. Now let's come here, I web element. Code is equal drive.find element by dot ID. And here you have to select, you have to select a file from the local drive, right? Okay, but you have to copy the path where the file is located. Example, my file is located in the C drive. Let's say this is my file. I want to upload this. Copy this. Copy this path of this file. Go back. And here, upload dot send a case. I will slash a name of your file. The name of the file is name of the file, which is GIF file dot GIF. And then I have to select and then how to let's say i'm selecting this and click on upload button and this is the id is equal to file submit so if you want to write write the driver dot find element i dot id dot click. So once you submit this file, then you'll be able to see this message. So I have to inspect this and ID is equal to file. This is displayed or not. The file is displayed or not. And I can see I web element file uploaded message. We call driver dot find element by dot id now you can verify if condition put if condition file upload message dot displayed if this is displayed i'm going to print in the console file uploaded successfully. Else, file not uploaded. Let's run this test and see. Now we have to now we have to copy this method. Done it. Yes. It has successfully uploaded and we can see this message. The file upload is successful. Now we'll jump onto the file downloaded. So how to download a file with this specific directory? Go to the file download. And when you click on this file download, right? Okay, but the default location is a download, download location. When you open this, it is in the download location. 
but I don't want this particular directory. I, I want to specify into specified directory. Example, I want to I want to store in the C drive. This is my folder, but I want to download the uh, file from the uh, application. Let's go here and do one thing. I'll, I'll create another method here, file download. Now let's copy the same code here. We need these four lines of code. Where Chrome options is equal to new Chrome options. Chrome options dot uh, or uh, Chrome options dot add user profile preference where you have to add the default download or default directory and your path of your directory where you want to uh, store it where you want to save it. Chrome options dot add user user profile preferences uh, initial dot indl dot accept underscore languages nl and Chrome options dot add user profile preferences, disable pop-up blocking. Sometimes you know, when you're downloading your file from the browser, it, okay, it is asking for the uh, a pop-up with the allow and uh, dismiss. So you want to you want to block that kind of you know, pop-up uh, uh, related uh, issues. If you want to block that in the pop-up related uh, uh, functionalities in the browser, you can use this particular profile preferences, this argument. So right after that, you know, driver, driver is equal to new Chrome driver of Chrome options and driver dot navigate dot go to URL. And then, and the, here you have to change the URL. And then now I have to click on this particular, particular file, which whatever the file you want to select, you can select it. This example, I want to go with the SAM, SAM, some file txt, inspect element. Right click on this one, copy, copy X path. Go back and here you can set it right, you know, driver dot find element of my dot X path dot click, simple. So as soon as you click on this particular file, it is automatically going to save in this particular directory. Which directory? This downloaded files directory because I already said I need to copy this path this here so we need to copy this we need to add this main method in the main method it is successfully downloaded to your location that's it that's it guys for today. Thank you for watching this video. We'll see you in the next session.